Good intentions don't always mean good results. And that was exactly the case for Cleveland's Balloon Fest in 1986, where they decided to simultaneously release 1.5 million balloons into the sky. The event was supposed to be a wholesome fundraiser, sponsored by the United Way, an organization that helps people in need. But even though it managed to bring over 100,000 volunteers together to contribute and help blow up balloons, and even though everyone involved had so much fun and was so happy, the event would soon become an absolute nightmare. All 1.5 million balloons were being held together by a massive net, and when they were all suddenly just released at once, it was truly an incredible sight. But since there was a huge storm coming a while later, the balloons ended up being blown absolutely everywhere. When the balloons started falling back down, they began causing traffic accidents and flight delays. And since balloons were just everywhere in the water, they actually prevented the Coast Guard from reaching and rescuing two fishermen who had gone missing that very day. Those fishermen were eventually found dead a few days later, and one of the widows eventually sued United Way for $3.2 million for inadvertently killing her husband. The owner of a prized horse who had been injured by the balloons also sued as well. It was also preventable.